Hello there! How's it going? This is here, this is me still doing my 30 round challenge around 11 here. And um, I've got a little friend with me this time. Got Matthew. His name's Omnix. And hopefully no one can hear this, but my Skype's getting spammed to fuck. Uh, that is a common problem with Skype. Once you add everyone, they will rape you with spam. I'm just gonna go tell him to die. Yes, that's a good. Nah, kind of harsh. Go die. Okay, good, 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 good. <laughs> what? You should probably tell us the zombies you're killing instead of all the people you're skyping. Well, yeah, I suppose I could tell the zombies to die as well. But more to the point, um, I'm <laughs> just gonna try to ignore it. Um, <laughs> oh my god. Um, well, here I am around 12. I just picked up double tap to start off the round, and. I don't know why. I hate double tap. I'm not gonna lie. You're not gonna I lie. I don't know if there's anyone else out there who hates double tap as much as me, but it's <laughs> so pointless. Well, I just I just use it because um, I use what's it? What's mule kick? I use mule kick on when I'm on my last last revive when I dumb when I die at the end of the game. I would just use mule kick then because if I die, I don't want to lose a gun because I don't know which gun it's gonna be. So at the minute I just go uh -huh. in for I just ch I just picked up double tap so I can spray them a bit more as you can see here. Yeah, cruising. So what should we discuss today, Matthew? Uh, zombies, I think, is the topic we're gonna go for. We're gonna go for zombies. Good stuff. Good stuff. I think it seems appropriate given the current situation. The current situation where there is um an amount of them in front of me here. Yes. Well, that well, depend depends which way you look at it. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna throw this out here just in case no one's noticed. These commentaries are not live. Yes. I, <laughs> I, I don't know if anyone actually knows that, but we've actually talked nothing about the gameplay apart from the fact that you have double tap. I have double tap, and that um, I'm starting off in the same place every every single episode. But what I'm doing here for uh, all of our three viewers, I actually have never seen this gameplay before, so I'm just kind of going off the bat here. I've seen it before, but I watched it earlier today, and I've lived it as well. But um, there you go, picking up double double points here, like a boss. I don't think I've got any ammo left. Oh, I do. I have no ammo left. So I'm off to go pick up ah. more more ammo because that's how exciting I am. Just keeping the action rolling here by picking up some ammo. <laughs> Damn fucking right. Well, well the common thing I've seen online when I'm playing with people is that they like to pack a punch guns that they get from the box. And in all honesty, I don't see why. I mean, yes, it makes your gun like a shit ton powerful, but... It's so difficult to get ammo again, especially when you have to wait seven rounds per dogs, isn't it? Seven rounds in this game? That's, um, it, I think it's a bit random at times. They go from like seven to six to five to seven. Like, sometimes you get dogs like at round seven, then you'll get it at round eleven or twelve. But generally, it's around about that. Yeah, am I right? Yeah. Because <laughs> I remember the good old days when we played World at War. I didn't play World at War. Dogs came, is it every three or four rounds? Three or oh, four World, of, World of War. <laughs> For some reason, right? For some reason, Matt, I thought you said I was thinking World of Warcraft there. And we definitely play that <laughs> all the time, all the time. No, like in World of War, dogs used to come just like every five rounds, like constantly. You can sort of figure it out. Which is a good thing. I it's think. good, but now it's just it's it's a bit random here. And I just had two dog rounds in a row. No, I'd only um, it's a little tip that I've picked up off of somewhere uh, that um. Instead of just pack a punching your gun instantly, if you got like a ray gun or something, is to get rid of all the ammo of it first. If you actually oh. just drain all the ammo, then um, pack a punch it. It's like um, a max ammo for you. That just costs a lot of money. See, I don't know this kind of crap. I I'm very newbie at zombies and. <laughs> <laughs> With a round thirty challenge on any map, be challenged there. Ah, okay. Thanks for telling me halfway through the commentary. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you think we're halfway through? Che, we're, I don't know, four minutes into 15 minute video because I've extended it. I'm extending the times of the video so I can get um, the rest of this, this series done in the next three episodes after this one. Oh, oh I hate those Nova things. Yeah, what are they called, Nova 6? I just call them Novas. You could call them Schmeagle. Or, or oh, Gollum. You could cho choose them. I like Schmeagle better because Schmeagle's a nice little, he's the nice one, but these ones aren't nice. Yeah, true, but true. it's annoying. Yeah, and um, like, they are fucking annoying. But you know, they're, they're like 
fast crawlers. They're like fast well, crawlers, crawlers that, like that fart in your face. <laughs> they're not very. They're not very nice. Obviously. And I've gotten to this stage, right? I've gotten to this stage of the game, where um, I haven't actually brought any other guns than MP40. I've got MP40 and I've got my starting pistol. But I haven't got anything else. And a max ammo, just as I pick up ammo. That's just totally That's karma. That's what have you done, Andrew? You've done something to piss <laughs> off cop. I know, but I don't. I don't particularly mind. Because it's ammo is only 500, and um, I can get that 500 back just by spraying them in seconds. Yeah, that's true. So I didn't really mind too much. I would have minded if I just like upgraded a, a thunder gun or some shit like that. Do, do you know what I'm confused about with Black Ops? Okay, explain. Why did they put World of War guns into Black Ops? That's that's the only major confusion. I mean. I'm pretty sure, well, with, if we get any viewers, that will probably just comment saying, oh, this and that, about like, this is why they put World of War. There's no logic to this. They took guns from about 1940 and put them today. Makes no sense. I know. Actually, what's even weirder is the fact that they put more Black Ops guns into the box as well, so now you're mixing cultures that probably never knew each other. And also, what makes the even less sense is the Dragunov. Yeah, see if I caught that there. <laughs> I think I'm looking into this too much. I'm thinking the Dragonov has been put into every single Call of Duty that I can remember, other than the World at War, and has been shit all the time. Yes. The, was, it, was it in Modern Warfare 2? I don't remember. Oh it no, it wasn't. Warfare. It wasn't in Modern Warfare 2. No. So it was, so it was other in than two other Call of Duties. <laughs> it's been in three. COD 4. COD 4. Black and Ops. This one. Black Ops in MW3 as well. It's an MW3? Yeah, sadly. Oh, look at that, viewers. I suck a cod. <laughs> Don't... Please, no one get frustrated on him. With him. Please. Not on him. Please. a pitiful noob. <laughs> so, what's up in? It's round 11, I had dogs, and now it's round 14. Yes. You have dogs again? Oh, no, no, no. I'm just thinking... I'm just trying to figure out in my mind how far it is to, to more dogs. You might have noticed the tiny little click there. That's me, um, pausing it for... Unexplainable reasons, as I do throughout this um, this gameplay. Like not this, not this particular video, but this whole the whole gameplay. I pause it randomly for time checks or for wanking or other stuff. You wank during zombies? Um, I wank during most things. That that <laughs> is some insane, like insane multitasking skill. Who said guys could multitask? Women. <laughs> Good answer. I'm gonna say that. Good answer. I, I think I, I I wasn't actually going for a good answer. I was going more along lines for a correct answer. <laughs> now, um, Matthew, you may be thinking to yourself, I had a box there and a lot of points, and I picked up a G something. Eleven? Eleven? I think G11. it's a G. G eleven. I'm gonna call it. Um, I picked <laughs> up a G eleven. You may be thinking, Andrew, why would you pick up a G eleven? Not really. <laughs> he is not thinking that. <laughs> but, if he, but if he was, I would be like, good question. Or good thought. Um, I, pi I only picked it up just so I could get um, more points. This is like all point whoring techniques here. For those of you who don't know to point whore. And have never ah, whore. Point whoring is something I like to do here. As you may be able to tell by the fact. Point like to do in most general situations. Just at any point you can, I like to G whore. What's it? P whore? I think it'd be P whore. P whore, but I don't know what G whore is. Is that <laughs> G11 whoring? Yeah, I think we should. G G11. I th this is a new thing. This is the G11 right here. We need to G11 whore more often. Or we just call it G whoring. We call it G whoring, yeah. G whoring. So Syndicate made Rape Train, we made G whoring. You heard it? You heard it, her? Blah, fuck, I gotta speak. You, hear, you heard it here first. G whoring. <laughs> G whoring. I call trademark. Somehow, on that. I don't think that's gonna take off as well as the rape train is. Well, no, because the rape training is like a massive technique and stuff. The G whoring is just a thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna mention it in every video I can remember. Like in the future, if I remember, I will definitely mention it. G whoring. Now I think, I think, um, what gun am I gonna get next? A spas. Okay, that's my. Th oh, I was gonna say karma dictates drug and all. <laughs> no, I, I, pick, on. I, I know. I pick up the Spas 12, and I know exactly the next three guns I'm going to get out of the box. 
But I'm not gonna tell anyone. Because I am sneaky. I'm anti sneaky. Yes. <laughs> so sneaky that you forgot to mention that this was not live half like four minutes into the commentary. Four minutes into the commentary and also two videos. Yes. Two videos and half and four minutes into the commentary. I remember yeah. to tell the audience that this is not live. In case they hadn't noticed. That should, that should be your next opening, just when you're opening, just like uh just a consumer warning. Warning. Not this live. Not live. Well, I opened a consumer warning about the fact that zombies don't exist. Yeah. <laughs> just, yeah. Only, if only. Yeah. If only they existed, we could all scream in the mornings and nights and stuff. Scream a lot more in life. Or rape train. We could rape train in real life. That, that's how you know when you're sad, when a zombie apocalypse actually comes and you find yourself uh, rape training instead of panicking. <laughs> I just love the moment where um, you look outside and you see someone running in circles around a dustbin with like heaps of zombies behind him. Oh, you should meet my neighbors. <laughs> Actually, no, you should meet my neighbors up until the point where they're being chased by zombies because they tend to run around bins a lot. <laughs> just because um, that's the kind of place we live. We live in a place where running around bins is just everyday shit. Yes. I. If you don't run around your bin, you're insane. <laughs> In the feed. Apparently. <laughs> Just apparently, yeah. Now, 21,000 points at the start of round 15 is okay, I suppose. Or at the end of round 15, I might say. That nuke wasn't very helpful in all honesty. No, zombies are still coming in, but I'm just trying to get rid of the rest of my Spass 12 ammo so I can uh, just get a new hit the box, you know? So I'm taking two shots to kill one zombie. I think it's a three. Yeah, three on this one zombie. Douche. There you go. I'm just trying to speak more about the gameplay. We haven't really been completely focusing on it. <laughs> on off in a tangent. Yeah, just on anything at all. So Matthew, I don't know. Christmas was nice. Y yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, Todd must focus on zombies. Must. And also another thing. Actually, we, should, we should start one of those comment things, like comment for your favorite shiz. Comment. That seems to get used, Can someone please comment their favorite shiz? Now, yes. we'll open no. the book, this could be interesting. No, don't comment your favorite shiz, because we're going to get random crap like rainbows and unicorns. <laughs> I'd, ra I'd rather see unicorns and rainbows as comments. So I got an RPK, then I get monkey bombs, that's two um, partially decent guns in a row. So I decided, you know what, I'm going for this again, I'm, go I'm feeling my luck. I'm feeling my luck. <laughs> oh, what? An RPK, monkey bombs, then as um, a thunder gun, as three guns to get in a row. I was thinking. I call hacks. <laughs> I think, like that's a pretty decent run. You know what? I'm not gonna lie. I've never had the thunder gun. You've never had the thunder gun. Never had thunder gun. Oh well. I've had the ray gun. That's any consolation to anything. <laughs> Ooh. No. It, it, oh, it, dogs. Ooh, dogs. So what is it? Round eleven to round sixteen. Round five rounds. Five rounds. Yeah. Five rounds. And I just. Blow the dogs to shit, as you do. With a thunder gun. With a thunder gun, it's just normal everyday stuff. This, like, also, like blowing up dogs with thunder guns and running around bins, is just normal. Thunder guns, pick one up at your local Argos. <laughs> Argos. What a uh, place Argos is. We're going off on another tangent, aren't we? Yeah, we are. We're gonna, we're gonna start talking about Argos now. Oh crap. We're gonna like have to put advertising stuff in it as well. Argos, that's the. Chiquitos. Chiquitos. Do we get copyright for crap like that? No, I, I thought I don't think they mind a, f a little bit of free publicity. And now we start mind. saying that we created Argos and try to set up an exact same store called Argos. Maybe they might not like that. Yeah. <laughs> or just people watching this video and then going to their local Argos and demanding a thunder gun. I would I would love to see that. Same. <laughs> Viewers, if any of you actually attempt it. Please record it and put it as a video response, because we would love to see that messed up shiz. We would love to see messed up shiz. Ma, I think I might do um, more um, dual commentaries with you. It's not the fact that um, this might go down well with subscribers and get lots of views. It's more the fact that it's much more fun to do commentaries with you than it is to do by myself. Even though we never talk about COD. Even though we never talk well, about we do. There's not much we to do. talk about though. Oh, frame rate dropped there. Oh, oh dear. Oh, oh, oh dear. It'll be fine, don't worry. 
And that's when the real point hiring begins. Oh, we're nearing the end of this video, aren't we? Um, we are nearing the end of this video, so thanks for wrapping up there, Matthew. We're going to have to say goodbye very quickly. This been Bye. This has been very fun, and thanks for watching. Remember to comment your favorite shows, and that's the end of it. Bye!